So good evening, good evening, good evening. We are back again with the Muppet Social Show. And this is going to be epic uh, because it is fully Hooters FC. Chests are out. I'm, I'm sorry I'm late. I had to dig myself out of the mud. You know, it's hard being in the mud. You know, it's so thick and so deep and like, you know, it's all over. That's probably why I look so fresh. Like, not bad, not bad. Six weeks till I'm 40. <laughs> it's all that mud I'm in. You know, it's good for your skin, people. Maybe try it. Maybe get in the mud. Or go another mud bath. Just do it. It's crazy. Big up to everybody. Big up to this guy as well. Where is he? Let me find this guy. Bro, you're Muppet number one today. Big up, Govand. This guy constantly bangs on about, don't watch people you don't like. Yes, he has a whole entire video dedicated to looking at Twitter accounts he does not like. <laughs> oh, can you predict what I'm about to do then? Because I actually wasn't. I was just going to search my name, my friend. Uh, but anyway, listen, I'm all, I'm all for it, mate. I'm all for it. And um, I don't watch these people, but I'm going to profit off of their stupidity because apparently I only profit when we lose. So let's profit off of stupidity as well. Thanks, mate. Anyway, let's continue. Let's continue. Let's see if there's any more Muppets in the chat because they've, they've all come back out the woodwork. They were in the mud. They were in the mud for three weeks. That's maybe why they're so fresh and so clean right now and coming with their chests. Who is FC back again? It is back again. Uh, big ups to this comment as well. Uh, as an Arsenal fan, <laughs> if you remember, you remember that. If you know, you know. Yeah, as an Arsenal fan, I'm looking forward to being back at my second home, hoping for XG, GA. <laughs> Don't need wins, just a good looking manager and players with nice toes. <laughs> yes. Back at my second home. You don't work at the Emirates, mate. It's mad. It is actually mad. Um, I'm very well to everybody asking me in the chat. Big up to all of you lot. Um, it was an epic win last night. And um, you know, it was fantastic. It was the the, the bus parade's going to be scheduled for the weekend. And um, the trophy's out. The beat Chelsea trophy. And um, yeah, congratulations. Well done. Uh, we won the cup final. Um, that's what, one cup final out of four. Because um, we had 10. It's only won one of them. Um, but don't worry, there's still plenty more to go. We can get the We Beat Man United, the worst Man United in living history um, trophy at the weekend if we beat them. Um, so, yeah, this is epic. This is all going to be good. Uh, make sure you are smashing the likes up, people. And <laughs> big up to my guy. I'm a United fan, Lee. Can't wait to see who will get the Muppet Socials of the Season Award. Yeah, maybe I should do, maybe I should run polls on it. Yeah, maybe I should do some polls on it and see who the Muppet of the Year is. <laughs> Can I just say as well, yeah, it is hilarious how many people I actually rattle. Yeah, and it's actually quite sad because as soon as we win a football match, they don't go and celebrate the win. Um, they actually come searching for Lee Gunner. That is how bad I am in these people's heads. Who knew I was so gargantuan? <laughs> it's actually mad. Uh, Conte has still get top four. Uh, well, you never know, do you? You know, listen, at the end of the day, Spurs are irrelevant, mate, apparently. According to our fans, they're irrelevant. Um, yet our fans were jumping around when Newcastle scored the other day, only to ship five later. Um, they were jumping around when Brighton scored in stoppage time. This is an irrelevant football club, according to our fans. Irrelevant. So why was you jumping for joy? Oh, and they are still above us. Irrelevant. Uh, Man United, worst Man United in my lifetime. And like I said, I'm an old man. Um, so, yeah. Um, it's kind of it's kind of peak, yeah. Worst Man United team in living history, or my living history, and uh, and our fans are gassed that we're sandwiched in between them and the irrelevant football club. And even even if we don't actually get top four, which is third loser, let's be real, that's not the aim of elite sport to finish fourth, is it? Uh, but even if we do get top four or do not get top four, um, as long as we finish above that irrelevant club, this lot will cheer it like we've we've won the treble. So they're not kind of irrelevant, really, are they? Because you have them on your brain all the time. A bit like me. Apparently, I'm irrelevant. Yet we're going to go through how I'm not. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Uh, there we go. Uh, big up to Arsenal fan 13. Um, we are on a lovely Rosado today. Um, very nice. Oh, you're an alcoholic. <laughs> Some of the comments I get are funny. Uh, you should check out AFTV community posts. Um the Arteta in Dink Riding comments are hilarious. The community post, I'll check that. Thank you very much. Lee Gunner trending, always, always trending. And thank you for the donation, buddy. Always trending, man. Every time um, every time we win or lose, Lee Gunner trends. Uh, it's funny because I'm not even on Twitter. And I trend on it every week. But um, they, they were cheering like they, they'd, um, 
they toppled the king when I got suspended. And um, now they talk about me all the time. Mad. Actually mad. Uh, these people... Um, oh, big up Scotty Boy Groomer as well. Big up to him. Yeah, big up to him. Yeah, because that guy has got chest again. Wants to start running his mouth about me again. Um, no doubt he'll be quitting YouTube again. Oh, I can't take it anymore. Can't take it. Oh, my God. I'll get bullied at work. Waster. Yeah, worry about your own life and less about me, mate. Yeah, absolute waster. That guy's got... um got a short memory as well because uh, I love to remind people of this every time he runs his mouth um so I'm Genu um he actually set up the Guna talk which is now owned by a condescending twat um but uh he set up the Guna talk in the heights of the Venger out days and his four go-to Venger outs were me Mems DT and Kenny Ken but but I am grooming negativity it, it's all me yeah, I think that guy's got a short memory. Maybe go to the doctors, mate. Um, maybe he can help. I don't know. Anyway, let's continue. Uh, big up to you, Lee. Hope the Rat Army are doing well. We're doing very well, man. It's 20 degrees here today. Beautiful sunshine. I can see Gibraltar. Um, I think Martin Odegaard stood in the Gibraltar rock. Yeah, he's on, he's on, the, he's on the Gibraltar rock. <laughs> Fresh off of the back of his five big creative chances this season. Well done. The creative spark that we've been missing. Uh, has the same amount of create big creative chances as Dan James and Kyle Walker Peters. Well done, mate. Uh, anyway, um, if we get top four, be beware of Luda Goretz. Don't worry, mate. We've we've got um we've got Martin Odegaard, mate. Got Martin Odegaard. <laughs> it's mad. Uh, worst United team since the seventies, where we got relegated. Exactly. There you go. There you go. Uh, where should we start? Why were you banned from Twitter? Because <laughs> uh, I called somebody uh, a, a, another word for retard. Um, <laughs> and I got banned for it. And kind of mad, really, isn't it? Um, it's definitely up there, mate. KY is definitely up there. I saw somebody say after, the, um, after Everton when we lost because Everton were up for it. Um, also, can I just say, yeah, uh, big up to all the fans that are overhyping Eddie and Ketia. Um, you are going to be the reason this guy signs a new contract and stays at the football club and leads the line next season. Yeah. Eddie and Ketia with his whole two goals of the season, putting his arm on their corner flag and cupping his ear. Right. Changed the culture, apparently. The culture has changed. First goal of the season and he's got that much attitude. Wow. Is it is that far up his own backside um, that he's kind of toying with whether to sign a new contract with Arsenal. Wants to think about it at the end of the season. You're lucky you're even here, mate, because you ain't good enough. He's a championship player at best. Um, but that's unfortunately the culture that Mikel Arteta has instilled into this football club that bang average crap um, can now decide to decide whether they want to stay at Arsenal or not. Um, it used to be an honour to play for Arsenal. Now it's, hmm. But there we go. Eddie and Ketty, you know. Uh, this is the same manager, by the way. Um, who offered Mustafi a new contract, and he rejected it. <laughs> he rejected it. Mustafi rejected the contract, you know. But there we go. Um, let's continue. Let's go. United have signed Ten Hag. Would you take him? He's massively overhyped, man. I've said this for weeks. And the thing is, he's going into a football club that is completely shafted. They need a, a project. Project reset. Um, they need a, a roadmap. <laughs> I'm sure all the buzzwords will be coming out soon. Um, but listen, I, I want um, I want Simeone, man. He was doing this call me celebration. Thank you for that, Divic. Was it was that what he was doing? I'm sure he cupped his ear. Maybe maybe I missed it. I don't know. Um, but there you go. There you go. Anyway, he did it because he was cut from their academy. Yeah, yeah, I know that. But come on, man, seriously. Oh dear. Yeah, I did see Tuchel blaming the pitch. I did. I did. I see that. I was like, "Wow!" Right. Uh, anyway, let's uh, let's get onto Twitter. Uh, let's search Lee Gunner. Lee Gunner. Let's go. Osh. Let's go. <laughs> Twitter's hilarious, man. It is actually hilarious. Big up to everyone watching as well. Over four fifty already, man. Come on, smash these likes up. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, for anyone who thinks that um that I'm still on Twitter because I've got a DM sat there, yeah. Um, let me just show you that I'm not. 
your account is permanently suspended. <laughs> it also says um, you won't be able to create new accounts if you think this, we got this wrong, submit an appeal. Uh, it's an IP ban, so I'll never be able to get on it ever again, which is kind of cool, um, but I can still search. So let's search. 15-year-old beef in Lee Gunner on a watch along. <laughs> All right, that kid, by the way. Oh, my days. That was hilarious. Oh, big up to the 38,000 views on that. Yes, come on. Big up to you, my friend. Uh, big up. Uh, let's go to the quote tweets. This is why people hate Arsenal fans. Because grown adults are hyping up this 15-year-old who really said nothing trying to tell fans who supported for decades about the club when the only thing they've seen is us win a cup. My boy, Alfonso96. You're a real one. You're a real one. This kid has the right idea about Arsenal, unlike Lee. <laughs> yes, let's just let's just ban anybody that doesn't suck off Arteta. Yes, yes, yes. I love that boy. He proper rinsed Lee. <laughs> he rinsed me, yeah. He got he got he rinsed me that bad. He had to leave. He just bounced and left. Uh, big up to uh, Power Spin One as well. Anti Top Gooner, yes, you're on my page. I don't think 15 year old made a single decent point in this clip. Man, speak truth. <laughs> ah, dear. Yes, come on. Hey, listen, this is kind of funny. I want to see the hate. Where's the hate for me? Come on, there's got to be hate on this post. This boy is getting rinsed, by the way. All he does is moan on YouTube. Yes, uh, Louis, I'm getting paid every day. You're crying on Twitter for free. Besides age and profiting, he's not made any clear points. Thank you. Big up my man for dunking on the pool guy. Who's the pool guy? This, this boy's getting a bit... Rinsed, I can't lie. What a legend, mate. Big up Jonesy. What a legend. Well done, Jonesy. 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 Fuck Lee Gunner. He told him straight. <laughs> Big up Andy. I love you too, my guy. <laughs> I, I want to see the hate. There's got to be hate on this post, man. These people are thick, aren't they? Look, this is what I said the other day about Arsenal fans being thick. So you've never seen Arsenal win anything. They literally won the cup when I was 13. The clueless melt. Um, if you actually listen to what I say in the clip, you've never seen Arsenal win anything of any note. Yeah. Um, anyway, let's carry on. There's got to be some hate on here. Where's the beef? Exactly. Where's the beef? Legend. What's his Twitter? <laughs> hey, these top gooners, they look exactly how I expect them to look as well, by the way. Here we go. Class. To be fair, the kid's saying what 95% of the fan base thinks of Lee Gunner. And the rest of the Bellins trying to feed off of an Arsenal loss. Um, I don't know if you know, mate, but we won yesterday. And I fed off of that as well. We're eating steak, mate. We're eating steak. Waggle steak. Uh, tell him, bruv. Even though I'm far tetter out, I love Lee being put in a spliff. Okay, mate. Yeah, maybe you should stop smoking spliffs. I don't know. Co-CEO of ODS Clothing. Has anyone heard of them? You've just got a free shout out. Um, the co-CEO. You mean you set up a clothing brand that's got no traction and now you're a CEO. Sounds good, doesn't it? These people are hilarious, man. The kid gets it. <laughs> just look at the reaction to the kid saying he's from London and goes to games. He was desperate for it to not be the case. Well, no, it wasn't. He, he sounded like he was from London. What are you talking about? Which is why I asked him where he's from. These people are actually thick. Superb. This sums him up. He tried to see where he was from. <laughs> and, was complete, it, and it was completely obvious what he was trying to get out of asking that. Completely shut down. You love to see it. Okay, Tom, you keep telling yourself that, mate. Thanks for watching. The brother went to my school. He's gone far. <laughs> I've been smoked. He smoked me. Yes, I've been smoked. Well said. Lee Gunner is a right. See you next Tuesday. Oh, Arshin, man. It's not very nice, is it? In the holy month. Come on, man. <laughs> 
getting dunked on by a 15 year old fucking wet wipe dunked yeah maybe maybe mayhem can come on and dunk as well i don't know this was funny as hell there's got to be some proper hate on it there's only a few come on man where's the real hate where is the real hate come on where's the real hate bodied him but how is he allowed to talk to an elder like that? Do you know what? This kid's like three years older than my daughter. I swear, my daughter speaks to an adult like that. She'll get a backhand. Mm -mm -mm. There's not really much hate on here. <laughs> that comment is hilarious. Big up to you, my friend. Um, Tommy Asu fanboy. Tommy Asu fanboy. There's not really much hate on this. Let's find something else. This is kind of not what I expected. Kids speaking facts. Well, he didn't, did he? Because he didn't even know how many wins and losses we had. He was just upset that I owe money and he don't because he's not old enough. But it is what it is. All right, let's go back. Let's see what else we've got here. It's got to be some proper ones in the comments. Come on. This is... Nah, man. We've got to find something else because this ain't, this ain't it. This ain't it, people. This ain't it. All right, let's go and find something else. Let's go. Lee Gunner. Yes, here we go. Big up to Han. Excited for Lee Gunner's Muppet stream. <laughs> Big up to you, mate. Lee Gunner, after seeing his age mate leading Arsenal team to victory against the Champions League and World Champions on their own turf against his wishes. No, that's you actually finishing yourself off, mate, at the, the prospect of finishing fourth. Let's go. I love this kid. Told him straight. Fuck Lee Gunner. He didn't actually say that at all. Someone check on Lee Gunner. Big up to my guy. Ross, Lee got cooked on, on, on his own stream. <laughs> Lee can't even say goodnight to his kids. It's kid, and I do, and I speak to her every day, mate. Well said, Lee Gunner, we've done that one. Lee Gunner was tetter out since day one. What was he cooking? <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear. Lee Gunner out here to do some cleaning up. Muppet Twitter out in full force. Oh, let's bring up a tweet from fucking 20 years ago. Bet Lee Gunner must be fuming. No, that's because I put we're all Chelsea tomorrow. Yeah, I'm absolutely devastated with the 80,000 views I got yesterday. Absolutely devastated. First they watch, then they hate, then they copy. Lee Gunner stocks. Oh, that was the 16th. Oh, okay. So now we've gone into. Oh, okay. This is how this is how fickle people are. Lee Gunner after another Arsenal loss. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually hilarious. I played this. That's actually funny. Lee Gunner was spot on. Fifty million pound prospect. Now, look, this is from the game the other day. This is from the game the other day. They called Lee Gunner a madman. Yeah, five days later, four days later, they're doing it again. Thought that was Lee Gunner. Big up Suchek. I do actually look a little bit like Suchek. I can't lie. What do you guys think? Do I look like Suchek? What do you think? Bang the likes up as well. I'll come back to the comments in a second. Let's, let's keep going. Let's keep going. This is actually kind of funny. <laughs> I never realized my name was put into Twitter so much. I am here to officially announce I'm Arteta out after watching Lee Gunner fan cam. He talks sense. I now stand by, fuck the process. I've had enough. Oh, let's We've got to watch the comments on this. This would be hilarious. Let's go quote tweets first. And fuck Arteta too. <laughs> For your mind, a cult you join... So you just want to have a rest with this decision. Mate, I can't even read that. Mate, learn how to fucking construct a sentence. You can't think for yourself. Arteta has been serving us rubbish football. You could not analyse it for yourself. You had to wait for Lee Gunner, who is not a sane person. <laughs> not sane. But that's all the mud I've been eating. Uh, Lee Gunner, tears. You don't have an independent fault. Well, neither do you, because you lot are being brainwashed by this football club. Clinton, big up Clinton. Yo, yo should remain calm and pick a spot. 
pick a spot, dude. Uh, if ever you've been Arteta in at any point in the last year, just stay there, please. There you go. My man has spoken. Clinton is the truth. <laughs> Another one has joined the army. Welcome aboard. This is funny, isn't it? Is this what people do on Twitter these days? I would totally understand it if you made the decision for yourself and not based on what Lee Gunner said. The guy is just trying to get attention and engagement. Um, can somebody tell this guy um, what the concept of YouTube is? I, I don't think he understands what YouTube is and what you're supposed to do is to get attention and engagement. The same as anyone who's got a social media account um, is not tweeting like this guy for nobody to see it, is he? So surely this guy's after attention um, and engagement. Mad. If you're on social media, you're not putting stuff out on social media for nobody to engage with it or nobody to give it attention, right? These people are clapped, aren't they? Like I said, Arsenal fans are the thickest fans in world sport. Uh, but anyway, let's go. Let's carry on. Let's carry on. That's all the quote tweets. Not many quote tweets. Let's go to the actual comments. <laughs> You'll enjoy next season when he's still here. Finally, you've seen the lights. Welcome, bro. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is actually funny. Twitter is actually funny. Welcome to the Rat Army, young Padawan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. To some of us, he's always talked sense. Welcome to the pie. Thank you very much, David. Come on, my guy. He has never talked sense it once, one time in his life. I'm with you on this one, bro. <laughs> Big up, Kenny. Good man, it's not working. Yes, you tell him. More replies. I'm glad you officially announced it. Fucking hell, who do you think you are? Paul's fuming. <laughs> uh, <laughs> this is actually funny. Look at this guy, he's fuming as well. Get fucked. Wow, these people are angry, aren't they? Let's carry on. Look at this guy. Lee Gunner won. This was last week. Lee Gunner feasting. This was last week. Funny how it changes in a week, isn't it? Watching Lee Gunner's YouTube channel for today's game. Non-stop facts. Big up, mate. You all laughed at me. Say, you're not laughing now, are you? You all laughed at me. <laughs> well, I have to say, you're not laughing now, are you? <laughs> what a difference a couple of days makes. This was like three, four days ago. Look. Ah, this this always comes up. Big up to Emma. Lee Gunner, who wanted this to be our lineup. Conveniently, the bit that's been chopped off said, potential starting 11. Did I say which competition, Emma? I didn't, did I? That could potentially be a starting 11 for Europa League, darling. Yeah? Could be, couldn't it? Th then again, having said that, Lacazette is still here. Um... El Nenny's still here. Adrissa Gay has gone on and actually won titles and trophies since he's uh, left the Premier League, by the way. Uh, Chilwell's done likewise. Um, Bellerin is shit, but he's still officially at the club. Leno's still at the club. Um, Dunk's better than um, Benjamin Shite. Reese Nelson was the pet project. Actually not a bad team, really, is it? Actually not a bad team. Lee Gunner, when Arsenal lose. It's taking it real hard. Ah, <laughs> uh, old Paddy Timmons. Lee Gunner was right about you. Should we go and have a little look at Paddy? Let's go and have a little look at Paddy. Let's go and have a look at Timmons. Martin Odegaard's first win as Arsenal captain. Oh, Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Colossal performance, you know. Oh, dear, oh, dear. Colossal. Man said colossal granite Xhaka. Colossal. Colossal, you know. It's, it's actually tragic that these kids have never actually been alive to witness the likes of um, proper midfielders. <laughs> like, they've actually grown up in an era that has been dubbed the banter era. 
kind of mad, isn't it? It's actually kind of insane that these kids have never actually witnessed greatness. So they have to lord up granite Xhaka. Let's continue. First pair of under 21 players for the same club to both score 10 plus Premier League goals in the same season since Rooney and Ronaldo. We get a trophy for that. That's another trophy, people. Another trophy. PFA Young Player of the Year pending. Um, probably not, to be fair. But there we go. He has done pretty well in fits and bursts. Rope holding, five at the back, cash money. Oh my days, this guy's cringe. Job done, on to Saturday. What do you mean job done? I've missed these full-time celebrations. Yeah, maybe the Amazon cameras are at that game. I don't know. Maybe they weren't at the last three. Maybe they weren't at the last three. I don't know. For a man who hasn't played a single minute of, for the club since New Year's Day, Mohamed El Nenny was phenomenal. Well, listen, he was pressing in stoppage time at Old Trafford last year. New lot wanted to give him a new contract. Then you're all crying that he was still here in January. Funny old game, isn't it? 50 GA and counting for the Arsenal. Just a kid from Highland with a dream. Fuck me, this guy is a clown. This club, yeah, it's clapped because of people like you. Anyway, when was the trophy parade? Saturday. Is it Saturday? No, Sunday, the trophy parade. It'd be a double trophy celebration if we beat United. Celebrate today's results with Arsenal shirts, home and away and third, 50%. Oh, is he selling fake shirts? Let's have a little look. Let's have a little butchers at this. Let's have a little butchers at this. Is Timmons on the fake shirt hype? Whoops, wrong one. Uh, is he on the fake shirt hype? No way has Timmons joined the fake shirt hype. Cheap replica jerseys. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear. And this, my friends, is exactly why these uh, accounts are fucking... I mean, look at this, come on. 30 quid for a fake shirt, a fake Arsenal shirt. Unbelievable. I wonder if Arsenal know about this because we know that they're watching the stream. So big up to Arsenal. Uh, we know that somebody from the club will be watching this because they watch everything. Um, but now Timmons is on the fake, the fake T-shirt hype. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. What is it with all of these top gooners? They all sell fake merch. Why do they all sell fake merch? And it's funny because um, I'm sure I've, I've seen him do this before, where um, two tweets before he posted this last time, he said, I love this club. If you love the club, you wouldn't be robbing it, mate. Yeah, because he is robbing this club. He is actually robbing the football club because he's diverting people and he's got 328,000 followers. Yeah, he's diverting people away from Arsenal's store to make money by selling fake Arsenal shirts, which, hmm. Yes, let's not forget this guy. He set his shop up again. Um, I think, um, what's his name? Um, who was the other guy? Pagan. Yeah, Pagan was selling selling fakes. What is it with all these top gooners? They're selling fake shirts. Why do they do this? It's mad. Shouldn't he get done for that? Yeah, it's fraud and deception. That's actually mad. Then they've got the audacity of these people to sit out here and say that I profit. I'm not profiting off of selling fake Arsenal shirts. <laughs> oh, no way. I'm blocked. So I can't even see him. Is he on that hype as well? Why is it with all these people selling fake shirts? Wow. It's mad. It's actually mad. Lee, if we get top four, just deactivate your Chanel. Uh, Chanel is a perfume, mate, that I don't wear. Wow. Tiki Taka's on it as well. What is it with all these people? I wonder if the club know about this. Do the club know that these people are like taking money out of the club? Let's see what else we've got in here. What was the code we could use? What was the discount code? Let's go and have a look and see how see how much we can actually get this shirt for. Let's have a little look. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Simmons is selling snides. Who would have thought it? Who would have thought it? Unbelievable. Unbelievable, Jeff. Let's see what the discount code was. 
Where is it? Use code Arsenal for an extra 10% off. <laughs> All right, let's have a little look. Right, let's click that. Bosh. Reduced from 70 quid to 30.99. Well, it was never 70 quid because it's fake. We believe in offering our customers with the best positive service, therefore offering a 100% money back guarantee if you're dissatisfied with your product. Wow. This is actually peak, I can't lie. This is actually mad. Unbelievable. Should we add a player on the back? Should we get El Nenny? Should we just put El Nenny on for the banter? Add to cart. Yes, we're viewing the carts. This is actually peak. Enter promo code, Arsenal. Twenty nine sixty eight. We get that shirt for. I don't know how they are so cheap. I'm not complaining. Brand new in official packaging with the tags as well. So lit. Yes, it's because they're fake. <laughs> Saw this company on Twitter and decided to buy it. And I have to say, I'm really impressed. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Really pleased with the shirt. Oh, my days. Oh, my days. Oh, dear. These are, they are 100% legit. <laughs> well, they're not, are they? Unbelievable, Jeff. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. All these top gooners are selling fake merch. Fake merch in the cut. Fake merch. Um, defrauding the football club. Taking money out of the club's pocket. Um, it's actually mad. Um, it's actually kind of sad as well, really, isn't it? Um, imagine, uh, imagine selling fake Arsenal shirts. <laughs> That is actually mad. <laughs> Some of these comments are funny, by the way. Uh, we're going to go through. Um, we're going to go through these super chats real quick. Uh, big up! Um, I couldn't believe this kid's confidence yesterday. He had more confidence than Odegaard in big matches. Mate, are you on about Eddie, yeah, bro? It's it's actually peak, isn't it? It's actually peak. I don't understand um, how everyone's gassing him up as well today. Well done! You scored two goals, the first two goals of the season, and now everyone's saying, "Give him a contract." Mikel Arteta saying he made a mistake on him and he hasn't given him enough game time. Unbelievable. Everyone getting excited because we beat Chelsea. We beat them last season and still finished eighth. Exactly. Exactly, bro. But these people don't get it. They don't get it. They just um, they just want to chat rubbish. Irrelevant wins um, that lead to nothing are irrelevant. This guy's put about 50 comments on Facebook. Um, I'd love to crave your chin in, you fucking blip. Um, we'll get on a flight to Malaga, mate, and I'll pick you up. You'd have to ask your mum for pocket money first, though, obviously. <laughs> Do your parents know that you're sat on um, on their internet um, spamming abusive comments on Facebook? Do your parents know that? Um, I don't think they do, do they? Especially, bro, in the holy month, mate, in the holy month as well. You need to get some manners, boy. <laughs> Uh, too much pressure on the players. Is yours gold? We're doomed. Yes, Marshall. They removed everything. We're doomed. We're actually doomed. It's mad. Thanks for the donation, buddy. Appreciate it. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. Ripping off the club they supposedly love. Exactly, man. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. They've got the audacity to sit there like going on like they're top gooners and they speak for everyone. Yeah, and then they sit there. And, um, and rob the football club by selling fake merchandise. I mean, come on, man. What is that all about? What, what is it about these accounts? Yeah, it's not just on there. It's on Instagram as well. Yeah, they're, they're, they're all at it. All, these, all the biggest accounts within the Arsenal family um, all sell fake merch. It's crazy. I had a guy come to me um, on Instagram and ask me to... Um, to send me a shirt, yeah, which was, I think it was a Christian Dior Arsenal shirt. Yeah, and I said, um, do Arsenal know that you're using their logos and everything and like Fly Emirates and all of that? It was like, 
um yeah it's not a problem i said no but do they know it was like nah i said well i ain't fucking promoting it then like it's mad it's actually mad how do we report it um i don't know to be honest i'd imagine just go and take the tweet copy it and send it to arsenal um i'm sure there'll be an email address um for reporting stuff like that i don't know mate i have no idea buddy no idea um but yeah kind of sad real isn't it um i missed a couple of super chats as well let me go and get them and then we'll go through the fan cam comments because they're just equally as funny equally as funny it's actually mad um where are we monetization super chats um maybe i didn't miss him Big up to you, Lee. Hope the Rat Army are doing well, said Jake. Uh, Jack, sorry. Um, I don't know if I read that, but I, ha I have now. Um, but yeah, it's actually insane, really, isn't it? That people think that they can just, like, you know, go and go and put a website out there right, that's literally selling fake football shirts. Yeah, but then they sit there on their Twitter account going on like they're the, the, the Messiah. It's actually peak. I can't lie. Right, let's go. My fan cam. Bro, this this guy, by the way, yeah, this guy has put twenty plus comments in saying that I, Arteta lives rent free in my head. Um, yeah, and I'm getting paid to talk about it. Yeah, I'm living rent free in yours for free. Happy days. Thanks for keep keep spamming the comments though. Just set, yeah, because I haven't used Facebook for a while. The algorithm's a bit dead. So the more comments you put in, Abdullah, the quicker the algorithm will boost itself up. So appreciate the love, bro. Um, thank you very much. Thank you very much. <laughs> Keep hitting the likes up. There's nearly a thousand people watching this. Um, so make sure you are hitting the likes up. Um, I'm going to be on with Henry Wright TV later tonight as well. Um, so keep your eyes peeled for that. Now, Lee, you are my favorite channel, says Lucas. Thank you very much, Lucas. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. Um, it's, it's cool, man. Appreciate the love. I'm a United fan. You're spot on my G. Big up. Uh, says um, Ejiro. Thank you very much, buddy. Uh, yeah, spam the likes. We're on 250, people. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And then we're going to share the screen and we're going to get the fan cam comments. Let's see what the fan cam comments are saying. Uh, video comments. Bosh. There we go. Let's start. Let's start at the very bottom. The first comments. Wow, there's loads. There's actually loads. Wow, look at all these comments on my fan cam. This is actually mad. This just keeps going and going and going. I didn't realize there was that many comments. Wow. I'm irrelevant. I am irrelevant. This is actually a joke. Seriously, is there that many? All right, that's him. I just want to see Arteta stay here forever to see this guy miserable. <laughs> uh, Lee Gunner out here again, lol. Why do you talk about other Arsenal fans than actual Arsenal football club? Odd behaviour, says Toby, uh, because they are the reason my club is fucked. How about that? You muppet. Let's keep going. <laughs> if it's going to be us that saves Arteta's job every season, then so be it. Trust the process, says Pedro Neves, the Chelsea fan. Uh, that's funny. Mm -mm -mm. The praise Eddie's getting is way over the top. Exactly. 100%, mate. Happy 420. Lee Gunner, you should be happy, man. I don't smoke weed, mate. Um... Like I said yesterday, that win just cements his position until next season now. I'm not even Arteta supporter. It's like you're disappointed Arsenal won. Don't be so bitter, says Manav. Um, I am disappointed we won the game because it's just irrelevant. It's irrelevant, mate. Let's carry on. Exactly. Arsenal fans screaming like they are back after, after that makes me laugh. Did you not remember beating us last season? Uh, when his job was also on the line. How did that work out? Exactly. Gunner, gunner, gunny, even. Gunny in the mud. Um, 
Big up to Bourne. Gunny in the mud. <laughs> I'm in the mud. He clearly gets annoyed when his team scores and wins the game. Yes, Nigel. Uh, it's a simple concept, mate. Um, but I know that most Arsenal fans are thick. Um, but it's a simple concept. The manager is not good enough to get us to where we should be and want to be, um, or I want to be. Um, so beating Chelsea just keeps him in the job for a little bit longer, mate. Yeah, whereas if he had got Pam yesterday, more and more people would have spun uh, uh, to our Tetter out camp and we'd be getting him out a lot sooner. And then the idea is you go and get a better manager. It's uh, it's kind of simple, really. It's really not difficult, mate. It's really not difficult. Stop dividing the fans. <laughs> Stop dividing the fans, mate. The only way I'm dividing the fans is if all the fans that don't like me come and watch it. Oh, yeah, they do. Oh, maybe they should stop watching it. <laughs> they don't like what I'm saying. Tough. Because I ain't changing, mate. I am not changing. You're dividing the fans. Yes, it's my fault. It's all my fault, mate. Nothing to do with the fact we've lost 11 games. Uh, currently sat fifth behind one of, um, one of the worst Tottenham teams we've seen in recent times. Um, just ahead of one of the worst Man United fans in their history. It's actually mad. Uh, 420 man like Graham Pothead in the mud. <laughs> That's funny. That's actually funny. I didn't expect us to win and didn't want us to win because I want the manager gone. He's not ready. Yes, come on, you know. You know, my guy. I'll tell you, we'll never win the Premier League Champions League and we'll get humiliated if he qualifies for the competition. I'll tell you, it's making Arsenal become the new Everton. I'll tear her out. Yes, Gadita knows. I am pro Arteta, but I've always said if he doesn't finish top four this season, I'd want him gone. <clears throat> so there we go. You have it right there, people. That is exactly why I want this team to lose. I'm pro Arteta, but I've said if we don't finish fourth, I want him gone. So basically, if we finish fourth on goal difference over Tottenham, that seen as fine. Um, but if we finish fifth on goal difference to Tottenham, then that's not. We're doomed. We are doomed. We are doomed. Actually mad, really, isn't it? The man took over a horrible team. It takes years to rebuild. He's the youngest manager in the league and the youngest team in the league. For a team that is the youngest in the league, has done pretty well. It will only get better. He's already won two trophies. I'm a Man United fan, by the way. And I'm being honest. Arsenal have a bright future. Oh, my days. Stick to Man United. You're more fucked than us, mate. Two trophies, you know. What do Arsenal fans actually expect to achieve under Arteta? <laughs> nothing. Absolutely nothing. Unbelievable. Some of these people. What's the point in celebrating a few battles when you keep losing the war? Facts. It's true. If Arteta wins one game in a month of April, he's a fucking genius and the greatest since Fergie. What is wrong with this fan base? A lot of people celebrating like we won the league. Yes, great win. But whether people like it or not, he's a dog shit manager. Thank you. Exactly. Be happy we won. Yeah, let's just be happy that he's going to be here for a bit longer. This is absolutely hilarious watching Lee get annoyed when Arsenal win. <laughs> it's a bit strange, isn't it? This is actually funny. Lee Garner doesn't bring the same energy when we win. He's always, already, <laughs> he's always ready to smoke us when we lose. But when we win, he's different. All I want is to bring the same energy when we win. I'm smoking everyone, mate. I don't know if you know this, but you obviously don't watch every day. This is actually mad. Why do you hate Arsenal so much? You support the club through the good and the bad. Respect the facts you're making a living from AFC. I'm not making a living from them. They don't pay me, mate. I'm making a living out of having an opinion on the club. It's not from them, is it? And uh, yeah, I do hate the club. I do. I hate everything that it's become. 
I love that people love to say that you're making money as well. They're like, well, am I not allowed to make money? I don't know if you know the un or grasp the concept of YouTube, but you do get paid for your views. Um, it's kind of peak. Uh, it's actually kind of peak. You get paid for views. Um, so the more views you get, the more you get paid. It's really not difficult. Um, but there we go. People are obviously very jealous and bitter that I get paid. <laughs> uh, big up, less one more. Come on, thank you for the super sticker, my bro. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Um, big up to Kane as well. Gunner versus BTEC and Ketia, WrestleMania 39. <laughs> uh, it's like your clap fan base have forgotten you lost to Brighton, Southampton, and Palace. It's hilarious watching it all, mate. Bro, it's absolutely funny, isn't it? It's like it never happened. Literally. Thank you, man. Uh, fans in South Africa worship Arteta. Oh, my days. Oh, my days. Rival fans have more standards than AFC fans. Exactly. It's actually mad, isn't it? It is actually mad. It is actually crazy. Anyway, let's go to um, let's go to Julian's fan cam. Let's go to Julian's fan cam. What am I doing here? What am I doing? Right, here we go. Go and see the comments on this. Videos. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Right, here we go. Here we go, people. Oh, shit, what have I done here? Right, smash the likes up as well if you haven't smashed the likes up. Smash the likes. Here we go. We're not going to play the video because they'll do me for copyright. Um, this guy was the only one on AFTV who's confident coming into this game. Yeah. Never underestimate the power of being released from a club. Eddie brought that confidence and belief. Yes, Arteta in. Seeing Arsenal struggling to get fourth is amazing. <laughs> This guy is always right at the end of the day. He is a fortune teller. I'm really amazed why he gets so much stick. Somebody said, is that sarcasm? <laughs> He's always right, is he? Somebody said, yeah, even a broken clock is right twice a day. Exactly. Can't wait to see Julian on EastEnders. Keep up the great acting. <laughs> oh, dear. This is mad. The professor of AFC. I love this guy. Mad genius. Rumours of Arsenal's demise were greatly exaggerated. Arteta and Arsenal should put up a statue of this guy at the Emirates. I really like him. Oh, dear. We've lost 11 games. Exactly. You know. People we need in this world. The Prince of Positivity. Oh, my days. This is actually mad. Three losses in four games isn't demise. Julian Shire not only is in-depth football knowledge, but also a superior intellect. Oh, my God. What did Julian say after Wigan won the FA Cup one season and then got relegated? <laughs> <laughs> it's one game. Exactly. This is actually mad. The same AFTV wanted Arteta out last week and the same one's kissing his ass this week. Exactly. It's a comedy channel. The clown is back. Julian is visionary. Who's his dealer? <laughs> Muppets. Yes. He has made it to the Muppet show. And on that bombshell, we're going to read out some of the comments and then I'm effing myself off. Um, big up to everybody who's watched live and on playback. There is 900 people watching live. Uh, big up to all my haters who are watching it. Don't comment. Uh, you know who you are. Big up to you. 
uh, you still can't stop me. You can't bully me into coming around to your way of thinking. Uh, maybe try that with other people because that shit don't work with me. Um, I actually have my own thoughts and opinions. Uh, you can't bully me um, as much as you'd love to. Uh, but there we go. That's why now what you do is that anybody that um, you talk to that's our tetter out. Oh, don't let Lee and Kenny um, pollute your brains. How about fuck off? Yeah. How about that? It's mad. Yeah, these people love to fucking tell people um, that they can't fucking associate with other people. It's fucking funny. Lee, you're relentless. <clears throat> yes, I am, man. I am. Best never rest. Ask me, is it Ozil? There's loads of room on the fence. Come join me. Exactly. Make it happen. No, nah, never. Never, 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 mate. Never in a million years. I'd rather drink bleach, if I'm honest. I'd rather drink bleach. Uh, big up to this guy who's still spamming Facebook, by the way. Thank you, mate. The algorithm must be going nuts. You put about 100 comments in. Thank you very much. Because um, I get paid on Facebook as well. I'm monetized on there as well. <laughs> oh, that's mad. You spent a lot of time um, in the comments as well, mate, talking about sucking dick. Is this something you want to tell us? Like, there's a lot a lot of your comments. I mean, listen, it, listen, it's 2022, mate. You can identify as a pink lighter for all I care. But listen, mate, do what you want. I think you've got a bit of a fetish going on, my guy. <laughs> Come on, there's one more, my guy. Love you, Lee. You do you. Always, man. Always. There's a lot of people that like to police um, people like me and um, like Kenny. They want to, you know, if you're, not in, if you're not part of the get-along gang, yeah, then uh, you're toxic, you're negative. And then everybody who does talk to you, um, that talks to them as well, they then get bullied by that group. So, oh, why are you going on his channel? Why is he coming on your channel? Why this? Who the fuck are these people? Yeah, who are these people? Like, I find it all hilarious. These people are tapped, mate. Every single one of them are tapped. Yeah, they 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 actually think there's something special. You're not. You're actually not. Like, I find it all funny. It's like some of the conversations I've had today with people where they're being bullied and stuff like um, about their thoughts and opinions on Arteta. Who are these people? Why don't you all fuck off? Do you know what I'm saying? Fuck off. It's mad. It is actually mad. <laughs> oh, some of these comments are too funny, man. Too funny. Pink lighter settings. Yeah, exactly. From now on, I identify as pink lighter. I'm not Lee Gunner anymore. His fast must be going well. Exactly. You know what I'm saying, bro? Yeah. Man's starving, boy. He's, he's been starving to come and fucking troll me for about three weeks. Yeah, maybe Rashford could pop, pop some meals around later. Like, do you know what I mean? Fucking idiots. These people are hilarious. And it's funny because these people sit there and say that I'm irrelevant. But then they all come here and watch it. It's the same as Tottenham. They say they're irrelevant and then spend all season watching it. All right, it's it's actually mad. People are actually thick. I, I keep saying this. People are actually thick. Last night, our fans at the ground were singing, um, you've fought it all, you've fought it all. Where's your owner gone and all of that? You've fought it all. These are the same people that want Cronky out to get an owner in to buy it all. Make it make sense. Make it make sense. Do you know what I'm saying, Perchy? It's mad. Like... These people, man, like I swear, the internet's given these kids uh, way too much confidence to be able to abuse people. These people would never walk into a boozer or into a fucking restaurant or, or anywhere and just have the chest that they've got. It's funny, man. Yeah, we see last night with that kid, as soon as I fucking stuck it on him about how many games we lost, he bounced. Yeah, because then he said, oh, you've been saying about Cronky out. I ain't been saying Cronky out at all, mate. Like, but the audacity to be able to get that Larry. My daughter's three years younger than that kid. If my daughter spoke to somebody like that, I wouldn't be surprised if she got a slap. It's mad. It's actually mad. It's actually mad. Look at this guy. Look at him. Look. You've spent the best part of an hour telling me to suck dick, that I'm a pussy old, that you want to come and spin my jaw, and then you're crying because somebody said something in the comment section. You're a fucking idiot, bruv. Yeah, but thanks for boosting the alg algorithm. Thank you very much. Report what you want, mate. <laughs> <laughs> I'm done. It man's even getting beef on Facebook from other people. Yeah, that'll teach you, innit? You absolute wasters. Big up to Mo. Mo Halimi. Big up to you, my guy. 
It's funny, man. It's funny. It's actually hilarious. Bro, these people, yeah, they don't understand. This is how thick they are. This is why I say people are thick. Without these people, I wouldn't have so many people watching, which means I'd get paid less because the algorithm has seen over 900 people watching this stream. When I come off of this stream, I'm going to have done the best part of four or five thousand views, maybe more. The average watch time is nine minutes, 47. That's average. Yeah. Then I'm going to come off of this. The algorithm is going to go fucking nuts because it's seen that many people watching for that long. And it's going to push it out to people that have never seen my channel before called unique viewers. If these people that don't like me don't watch it, I'd have less unique viewers coming to watch my channel, which means I'd get less subscribers. I'd have less views and less money. They're thick. They're actually thick. But I'm all for it, man. Keep it going. Keep it going. It's actually sick. It's actually sick. It's funny, man. Like, every day. It's it's mad. It's actually mad, yeah? Big up to all these people, man, because they wake up and the first thing they think about is, right, let me go and see if I control Lee Gunner today. Arsenal win a game. First thing they do, right, let me go to Lee's watch along. Like, then they sit on their Twitter talking about me. Then they put clips out about me. Bro, these people are actually fucking obsessed. It's actually funny. Like, I didn't realise I'd trigger so many people. But it's I'm all for it, yeah? I'm all for it, mate. I will trigger these people every day. And there's nothing they can do about it apart from cry, which boosts my views anyway. Thanks. Like, the 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 um, 38,000 views on Twitter. I'm not even on Twitter. Thanks. Do you know what I'm saying? It's actually mad. <coughs> Big up to Harry, man. Haters only want to see you... Haters only want to see you succeed, clearly. Not succeed, I think you meant, mate. Um, but yeah, bruv, listen, I've never seen a hater doing better than me. It's as simple as that. It's free promotion. So big up to them. Thanks. To my marketing team are working hard today. Is it snowing? There's snowflakes everywhere. It's amazing, isn't it? None of these people have rocked up for three weeks, bruv. They've been absolutely fucking starving. Um, and now three weeks later, they've all got their chests out. They're like all running their gums. It's actually funny. Um, I prefer not to speak. I prefer not to speak Arsenal 13. Yeah, I prefer not to speak. I prefer not to speak. It's mad. It's actually mad. But big up to everyone who's um, dropped donations, dropped comments and all of that. Appreciate it. Thank you very much. Um, it's mad. Do you know that our home record is legit eighth place in the league? Lol. Is it really? I never knew. I actually never knew. Uh, but there we go. But big up to everybody watching live and on playback. Big up to um, everybody on Facebook, including the guy who's boosted the algorithm. Big up to everyone who's absolutely drilling him as we speak, by the way. Uh, <laughs> unlucky. Um, anyway, I'll be back at six o'clock on Henry Wright TV. So make sure you come and check that out. Uh, love the channel. Chelsea fan here. How good was Bergkamp and Zola? Absolute two of the best players I've ever seen in the Prem. I totally agree, mate. Bergkamp's the best footballer I've seen at my club, and Zola was a bad man as well. Absolutely quality. Um, so, yeah, man. Yeah, but they don't make him like that anymore. Now we have fans jizzing over the likes of fucking Odegaard. Yeah. Yeah, mad. Thank you for that, Alan. Um, UK Drilly as well. Lee, if Lee didn't exist, AFTV would be, be deluding 100% of the fan base. <laughs> there you go. It's mad. Thank you for that, man. Um, they hate you more than they love Arsenal. Facts. Facts, facts, facts. And I'm all for it, mate. Bring it. Keep bringing it. Boost the algorithm, people, by smashing the likes up. Um, big up to everybody who's um, done that already. We're nearly on 400. So anyone who hasn't, smash the likes up. Uh, big up to everyone who's dropped a super chat in as well. We're profiting off of Muppets today. Um, so thank you very much. Uh, do 20 minutes more. I can't. I'm starving, mate. Yeah, I'm actually starving. So I'm going to go and eat. Um, so, yeah, man, um, I'll be back again on here tomorrow. Uh, all have a wonderful evening, and we're out of here. Oh, I missed a super chat, did I? Which one? Which one did I miss? Which one did I miss? I don't think I did, mate. If I did, I can't actually currently see it. Ah, I did. <laughs> That's what these people do, man. Yeah, that's what they do. I, I guarantee if I gave him the link to come on the channel, he's probably about 14. It's like they, these kids, man, they feel so comfortable. Um, they feel so comfortable um, 
running their mouth to adults it's actually it's actually mad and it will get these people in big trouble one day because somebody will just punch them up um it might probably do them a favor because then it'll, it'll soften their attitudes and um they, they'll then actually realize they can't run their gums so much to people um because all it takes is one good idea and um they'll shut up um but yeah big up to everyone who's put the uh, the donations in i have actually read them all i think i think i have actually read them all so so yeah we're out of it, people. Um, I'll be back at six o'clock. The 20 quid super chat. I read it, man. Um, from Les One More. Lee, love you. You do you. I read it, people. I read it. <laughs> I read it. <laughs> Scroll back. I read it. But thank you to Les One More as well. I read it twice now. Uh, but I did actually read it the first time, people. Uh, they all stuck to their bed sheets. Exactly. We'll end on that. That's what I'm saying, man. I know it's half term and all of that. Do you know what I'm saying? But boy, these kids are clapped. Um, worst worst generation of uh, of kids ever, but there we go. Everyone's saying I've missed another super chat. I don't know which one. Make it happen. Slaps and sense into Julian. Never. There was another one as well from Malcolm as well, but they didn't have a comment. Thank you, mate. Um, but yeah, I've done them all, people. I've done them all. Thank you very much to everyone who has dropped a super chat in, man. I do appreciate it. Thank you to everybody else as well that's put comments in, likes, shared, um, watched. And uh, my boy Mara's, yes, scored again yesterday, keeping the title race alive. And uh, we're out of here. Laters. I'll take her out. <laughs>